Hello ladies, blokes and non-binary folks, it's Ant here and today we're playing Metroid Dread. Um, I didn't actually buy this, um, me, me house mate got it and he's got out for a run. So before he's had a chance to play I've stolen it off him and I'm recording the video. Ha! That's, that's the only way I can play new games nowadays. Adjust bright, I can't, it's fine. It's fine, I don't want to be too scared. I'm being a bit stupid, I haven't set this, I haven't actually got this running through the Elgato to my TV, I'm just using the preview window on the Elgato, so I'm not seeing this at its best. Um, slightly blurry, it comes through at like 720p, but it'll be fine, I'm only, I'm only recording a Let's Play, I'll play it properly another time. Fine, quit moaning, it'll still look good on the video, what? I shouldn't even mention it. Right, Metroid, we know what a Metroid is, a virulent floating organism that drained energy from its prey through physical contact. Metroids were originally created by the Chozo, and named after the word for Ultimate Warrior. Their value as a bioweapon sparked several crises, and as a result, all traces of them have been eliminated. They are now extinct, which is kind of harsh. You, you basically made a species extinct. <gasps> oh, that's the fiend from Fusion. X-Parasite, a gelatinous parasitic organism indigenous to the planet SR388. It could absorb the DNA of its host, living or dead, and replicate its form. When infecting a living host, it could even access the host's memories. Ooh. X-parasites were driven not by emotion, but by an instinctive need to replicate and spread to an increasingly stronger hosts. Their inability to be controlled marked them as even more dangerous than their sole predator, the Metroids. Like the Metroids, they are believed extinct. Ooh, we have, I played Metroid Fusion. Metroid Fusion's great. You should play that. They should put it on the Switch. This is all from the intro of Metroid Fusion, isn't it? You get like the fusion suit. When no Metroid surviving, with no Metroid surviving on SR388, it became infested with the X, horrifying parasites capable of imitating and living uh, li any living being. Unaware of this, I set foot on the planet, got infected, and almost died. That was silly of you, Samus. Can I get? I want to play the game for a little bit at least. There you go, there's the fusion suit. It's pretty cool. So I guess this is set straight after fusion then. The only thing that saved me was the vaccine created for Metroid DNA, which also left me uniquely able to oppose the X. This ability was tested immediately when I went to a biological space laboratory's research station to investigate a distress signal. It's tell us what happened like 20 years ago. Was it 2003? Metroid fusion came out? Oh, it's the clone, and we blew it up. There I battled many powerful X-forms, including the SAX, which was the X mimicking me in my power suit at full strength. I eventually eliminated the X-menace on SR388 by setting the BSL research station on a collision course with the planet. Fusion's fantastic. Like, it's Super Metroid and Fusion, the two best ones in the series. But how will this stack up? After that, the X and the Metroids were just memories, or so we thought. Just when it seemed over, the Galactic Federation received a mysterious video transmitter. To be honest, when you're talking about intergalactic spacefaring things that quite often get on board space stations and spaceships, the chance of actually eliminating all of these is pretty slim. It showed an X alive and in the wild. Thorough analysis proved the video was real, although the sender was unknown. The transmission was traced to a particular planet. Which planet? What planet is it? Is it Earth? It was called Zd. If the X had somehow escaped extinction out there, they could pose. They would pose a threat to the entire galaxy. The Galactic Federation dispatched a research team of seven ME to investigate. Just like put a fence up around the planet and tell people not to go there. Pretty bad. Oh, some sort of robot. An ME is a large research robot designed to capture field samples and extract their DNA. Their incredible mobility and protective plating made the strongest stuff in the universe. What? Practically guaranteed the mission success. The strongest stuff in the universe. But not long after their arrival on ZDR, all communication was lost. Zeda? I need to. I need you to specify what the strongest stuff in the universe is. We're we talking a metal. We're we talking human will. What is happening on ZDR is the planet really infested with an X, with X, as the only one immune to the parasites. It's up to me. They go there and find out. Yay! 
game time. What are the controls? I didn't play that remake of Metroid 2 on the on the 3DS. Because, I mean, who buys 3DS games um, after the Switch came out? I didn't. Um, port that to the Switch, so I don't have to get a copy of it on the 3DS. Ooh. Apparently this all runs at nice 60 frames per second and everything. It plays all super smoothly. Apparently it's selling really well, it sounds like. Which should hopefully let Nintendo know that maybe people would like Metroid games. That'd be nice. It's with Nintendo are weird sometimes. They'll just happily let a franchise lay dormant for like 10, 20 years. Despite everyone screaming that they want a new one. I don't like this ZDR. ZDR. Did, uh, did she ask for the computer's opinion? That's okay. It's the same as we're talking about. Nuke the planet from space. That's what I'd do. There's no one else on it. Apart from those Emmy robots. Emmy means latte. Oh, have I got a new. What's going on there? Is that a different costume? Oh. What's happened here? That's not what I was wearing a minute ago. Doo -doo. Oh, it's a Chozo statue. They got everywhere. Oh, are we going to play a flashback where we get some sort of upgrade and then lose some powers or something? She doesn't talk much to Samus, unless it's Metroid Other M. In which case you don't shut up. I never played Other M. I guess she's got like a hybrid costume on now. <gasps> what is that? Some dude with a big gun. Wee! Oh, jumping, she does. that's good. She can, she's good at jumping, is Samus. She can do flips, do screw attacks. She can roll up into a ball. I'm surprised there was no mission leading up to this encounter. Oh, you've upset him. Something happened. Costume's different, it's all gone blue. It's clashing. Kind of blue and red. Orange and teal, maybe. I mean, go. It's kind of neat we're getting this, though, because, like, you know, there's. We've got the Metroid Prime coming back next year, haven't we? Right, it's Metroid, so I'm going to go left. Charge shot? No. Do you have rockets? What am I using? Just check him. Okay, that's my aim. That seems to be the same thing. I don't know what that does when I press the R button. I guess it will tell me in a minute. Whoa! Oh. 
Easy enough. See, I'm a Metroid Master. ZL to slide. What? There you go, got it. Hold L to use flea, very free aim mode. Until so we hit that. There we go. Can't get through there. I'm sure it will tell us how to do that in a minute though. Oh, that was a worm thing. Didn't like that. That was scary. Really good aim on me there. I've got great aim. Is that a save statue? Ammo already at maximum capacity. That's cool because I've got infinite ammo. Can't get through there. Oh, look, she grabs the ball. That's nice. Nice touch. Hold R to ready missile. Oh, you got to hold R. Press Y to fire. Okay. Some destructible blocks are hidden. If you run into a dead end, try shooting at your surroundings. Striking some blocks with missiles may reveal how to destroy them. I don't know what that means. Okay, so that's a different type of destruction. We can slide straight under that. So can I hit these with a missile now? Okay, you know what? Going back. You ain't, you ain't telling me what to do. I'm going to break all the rules. So can I aim rocket and shoot rockets? I can. Do you know what? Yeah, because you see, you can't tell me that now I can open those with rockets. I, f I completely forgot that you hold down the rocket button. You can't tell me that now and not expect me to run all the way back here and shoot that with a rocket. Is that not enough? Is that... You cheeky bastards. I thought that was a rocket door. Fine. Fine. I'll do what you want. Yeah, I'll shoot that thing as it runs away from me. Why not? Is that a rocket door? No. Got him. Oh, does she auto aim? Oh, you can just you, you can run and push the direction. Okay, I got you. Here's the thing: some of this is new to me because I haven't played. Um... Oh, I just wall jumped. Because I haven't played Metroid thingy, uh, Samus Returns. So some of this is like trying to get the hang of it for me. So it's the yellow. Okay, they're yellow and orange. They're different colours. I didn't notice that. More cutscenes. So I'm drinking my extremely cheap Coca-Cola. I've got a 39p bottle of Coke from Sainsbury's. So I skipped a video last week. It was I was just shattered. Had all sorts of stuff behind. I'm trying to catch up with videos. I've got to start working on a Yopper Ranger video later. Um, we did um. Did a vote on Twitter, and people voted for an episode of Live Man. So that'll be the next Yopper Ranger over on Yopper Ranger, I guess. The next, uh, whatever. The wonderful analysis. Oh! It didn't make us play through that whole sequence this time. I am checking the Federation database against your video log. It appears to have been a chozo. The attacker's identity is not yet clear. Makes a change to not have to play through the bit when you've got all your powers at the start. I guess it's a bit redundant these days, isn't it? We've done it enough times. Okay, I'll go upwards. Oh, they done it a bit like um, the Metroid Prime games, where it's like a separate areas you may encounter pockets of low temperature your metro DNA renders you vulnerable to such environments spending time in cold areas will be harmful to you there are many such cold areas scattered underground do not enter them with your basic power suit oh we're gonna get a cold suit underground interference is preventing radio transmissions 
check in with me at any network stations you find. Oh, it's, it's good that he cares. Yeah, I'll save my progress. We'll do a little bit more before we end this Let's Play, because, let's face it, we've only just started. Uh, plus to open the map. There's a map. Helps to have a map. That's an ammo recharge station. That's uh, We don't know what that is yet, but we'll find out later. Is there a global map? Okay. So, yeah, there is separate areas. What's minus two? Options. Adjust brightness, rumble, system. What's on system settings? Again, Nintendo has next to no accessibility settings on their games. And they seem to have a habit of hiding the... Um, not like not telling you about options until much later. It's rare that Nintendo go, here's the options before you start a game. So yeah, that's orange. Can't open that. I should remember that, shouldn't I? <gasps> oh no, it's a bug! Use a melee counter at the right moment to parry certain attacks and automatically take aim in the attacker. Press X to use your melee counter now. It's X. Oh, that thing. Parry enemy attacks with a melee counter. Press X at the right moment. Okay, I can do that. I mean, I didn't, but I could. Like I say, I didn't play Metroid <laughs> Samus Returns. Oh god, I can't. I need energy. There's a slimy guy, let's shoot him. Right, okay, I need to press X on those things, don't I? No, I did it. I got my energy back. Oh, X is not the most intuitive button to hit. <laughs> if it was a shoulder button, I'd be ready for it. Uh, nothing there. Oh god. Oh, he's too close. There you go, I blew him up. It's fine. Oh. That's got no... No thing on it. it must be a one-way door. What's going on here? Oh, is it telling me I need to go back that way? If an area of the map is blinking, it indicates that a hidden item is there. Ooh. What's up here? That looks like it's open. Wait, how do I get out of here? How do I get out of this? I am... am I stuck? Did I just... Did I just get myself stuck? That's not... Oh, hang on. Okay. There you go. What's this? Missile tank capacity increased by two. I can't have that. Can't believe I almost got myself stuck this early on in the game. Okay, that's taught me something, though. Whoa! Oh god, I fell down a hole. Oh, that was that was a prat fall, wasn't it? Jesus. That's been a while since I've played a new Metroid game, isn't it? I mean, it's been a while since anyone's played a new Metroid game. Hey, it's Emmy! The Cafe Latte thing. I like Emmy Cafe Lattes, they're nice. Sponsor me, Emmy. Oh, it's big and scary. Do I melee it? An enemy's attack can be countered by pressing X at the exact moment in the flash. However, the time is extremely difficult to gauge, making this a desperate manoeuvre. Okay. Oh. Whee! Okay, got it. Run away. Boink, boink. Keep running. Oh, it's Emmy. Just 
can't climb. That's okay. Yeah, she can't climb. I'll just leave her. That was scary. I almost spooked myself. Ooh, what's going on here? Butterflies. I guess Nemi's been infected with like uh, the X parasite thing in some new way. Oh, do I get an upgrade? Du, 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 du. What is that? The energy from the central unit transformed the arm cannon into the Omega cannon. Omega blaster online. Does that mean I've got better guns? Hold L to use A mode. Yeah, we want that. If target nearby, Samus will automatically face that direction. Okay. Hold R to charge the Omega Blaster. And once charged, press Y. Okay, like that. There we go. Just trying to fill in parts of the uh, the map there. That's kind of neat. Can I shoot that? That looks like a thing I could shoot, doesn't it? No, it's not. Why well, has my my best friend left me? Well, ah, I pressed. I didn't know when the time was. Where do I continue from? Has that screwed me over? Okay, let's continue from here. Got it. There you go. Right, let me fill in part of the map here, because you know that's a that's a whole thing. So I guess I'm taking on this Emmy now. I pressed the X button. Oh god. You want a chance to escape being captured by an enemy, but I was just, I don't know, what's the charging thing not doing anything? I'm guessing I'm supposed to shoot her in the eye with the charge. I mean, look, it's bright and red. Uh, takes quite a while to charge. Right. So let's see. Yeah, things going to come through. Oh, look at that. There you go, didn't have much time there, but I did it. There you go, see I only took a few attempts. <laughs> I've heard the game's really difficult, and that's obviously the most difficult part of the game, so, you know. Props to me. The Mega Can depleted and offline, reverting to regular rocket. Okay, so how do I... When do I get an Omega Cannon? <laughs> oh, that's unlocked now. It's broken, though. Oh, we're back here. Okay. But now we open this, didn't we? There you go. Ooh. What's this? That's a Chozo thing. Yeah, I'll save my progress. I'm probably. Uh, how long have I recorded for? Is that just a save room? Okay. Oh, I'm not doing. Oh, yeah, I'm doing flips. I thought I wasn't doing flips in here. Oh, don't like the look at that. Look at that, it's a spider. So when do you get the Omega Cannon back? Is it just certain moments? Is, that looks like a destructible wall. It's not. Oh, that's water. You know, probably shouldn't have wasted um, rockets on that, should I? Oh, I can't go under there, can I? Oh, I've... that's like a one-way path. Okay. Ooh. Weird thing. Okay. This game's already giving us weird stuff. Is this going to be a boss battle? I've heard the boss battles are really nasty, and I don't want to take on a boss battle on this video, because... Oh, look bad. Oh, we're in a new area. Okay. So we've got power beam, missile. Right, so what's going on here? Is this a new area? Or is it not? No, it's still part of this. 
I'm guessing those are walls we can't jump off of. Yeah? No, we can. Okay, we can do the... We can do the Samus jump thing. Is that door locked? Yeah, that door's locked. Let's have a... Snoop around. Actually, it seems like your jump off of there is actually a bit... Yeah, a bit bigger. Okay. That must be a thing later. Oh. And we don't have that Omega Beam now. And this one doesn't look as broken as the other one. Oh, no. Yeah, none of that's working, love. Whee! Ugh. Keep going. Uh, uh. Oh shit. When is the blink? When do I press it? Hold on. It says to press it when the thing flashes, and I'm pressing it when the thing flashes. I'm not good enough. Where do I go from there? Do I just run back through the hole in the wall? Is this like a... Is this going to be a loop? I do like this not sending you back to the last save spot. That's nice. I imagine that only maybe only happens when you've got some sort of significant event happening. Wasting my rockets. Right, okay. Let's see if we can figure this out. Uh, boink, bounce, bounce. No, not that way. Oh, I don't think this is the way I'm supposed to go. I think I'm supposed to go this way. Oh, hang on. No, that kick wasn't the right time. I think I'm meant to go under that water, aren't I? I saw that. Let's try this again. This, this is too action-packed for me. I can't handle it. This game's difficult. We watched this cutscene. Can I skip it? <laughs> this does feel really good to play, though. I'm getting just... A bit tricky with the amount of game controls that require multiple button combinations, which isn't the most accessibility friendly, but Nintendo's kind of terrible with accessibility options. They're like literally being left in the dust by Sony and Microsoft these days. No. Nope. Boing, bounce right up here, keep running. Oh, not in there. Guessing later it'll be a thing I can go in. No, not this way. I want to go there. Ah, okay. Maybe it's not that way. Oh, you can't get in here. Ah, okay. Okay, let me out. Oh, guess he can't go in there. Now, which way do we go? That's locked. That's not nice. That was my favourite place. So are they, are they bounce pads? No, I can bounce with this. So what's the blue? Missile tank capacity increased by two. Oh, I'm blocked off from there. I really shouldn't run under that. I don't know why. I, what I expected to happen when I ran under there. Oh, this is the computer. Okay, we'll we'll end the let's play here because I. I was thinking this would be like a 20 minute quick, like, you know, let's show the intro sequence. I thought there was going to be one of those sequences where, you know, you have all your skills and you lose them, but the game just skipped that, which is refreshing. Yeah, that's okay, they are pretty hostile, although I love the caramel lattes. 
sounds in the air within a certain range. Essentially, they can hear you. <gasps> I could use microphones for that as well. An enemy enters surveillance mode to track their source. Stay out of its line of sight when this happens. Otherwise, the danger to you increases dramatically. An enemy that has seen you will begin pursuit. Part of the pursuit protocol is to seal the enemy's own exits. You will be trapped inside. Oh. To survive, you must leave its range of pursuit. Evade the enemy and it will disengage. This will also unseal the exits. Alright, ah, so he can't go through that small hole? Never or the water? Zone. Their control system must permit them to operate only within that range. Oh, I'm guessing there's a um, a sort of quest I to take them all out. Probability of death if an enemy captures you. There may be a very small opportunity to escape, but exploiting this window will be virtually impossible. The enemy are immune to your current weapons. You lack the unique energy used to defeat the first enemy. Your only option now is to evade capture and find an exit. I'm guessing we get an Omega cannon upgrade later. Should be simply to survive. I don't like how it gave you that power and just sort of took it away arbitrarily. Like, there should have been a logic to it. But, um, yeah, there we are. We've, we've done that. We can't get through that. Boom. Can't get through that door. We can't get through that orange door up here. This one's locked. We can get through that one over there. But that, I think we'll, we'll, we'll save there. Oh, it's a... It's not a hold to crouch. I just noticed it's not a hold to crouch. We'll, we'll save there. I'm going to give this a go later whenever Matt's not playing it, I guess. Um, during the week. I don't have a day off for days. Working too much. But um, that's Metroid Prime Judge Dread. Dread. Dread Prime. Which is, um, yeah, so far that's, that's really nice. I'll catch you all later. And, you know... Um, Drink water or something. Look after yourselves. Bye. Love you. Bye.